Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and my name is Crazy Lightbulb. Uh, let me go ahead and move that real quick. Sorry for you guys. I know. Uh, and I'm going to adjust the light real quick so I'm not shining like a bright person. All right. So much better. Um, yep, much better. Okay. So, all right. Let me just adjust it more. Okay. Sorry. I'm trying really hard not to blind you guys, and it's kind of nice with this nice atmosphere. So, anyways. I finally did it. I got the parts. Now, unfortunately, when I looked up online, there are no legs available at the time. The only way you get the legs is by making them your own and making your own legs. So eventually I will get to that to make the whole outfit match. Um, I am carrying a lot more weight. The pieces are heavier. They are very heavy. Uh, 15, 15, 14 for the helmet and a 26. But I'm still carrying the same weight, so I went from 340 back up to 370, but I am 192. So I won't be able to carry as much, but I'll be pretty strong. Um, so the pieces, and I put uh, a cunning, uh, the synth leg on, which gives me plus one to perception, plus one to agility. And this one, which gives you 10% uh, chance to freeze melee attackers once every 20 seconds. Which is good. I mean, that's not too bad. Um, also, this one reduces damage while standing or not moving by 15%. Uh, this one also gives me uh, uh, plus one to perception and plus one to agility, which is going to help. And this one does temporary slows time, uh, slows time during combat when you are 20% less so you're yeah so it's kind of it's really nice like this armor is really nice uh i hope to get the legs to match because honestly these synth legs look really stupid on me right now and it's like ah so but yeah so oh man i'm really trying hard to adjust this light but i don't think this light's working you know what maybe i should just go dark oh my god going dark actually works so maybe i should just go dark okay because you guys can see me, right? You guys see me with the screen? Hello? Yeah? Okay. Uh, if anything, hold on a sec. You might see underwear. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Does that work better? Yeah, that works a lot better. Okay, so I'm using the big light. All right. So, uh, so I did all that. Uh, by the way, crazy light bulb here. Uh, just as a reminder, because I don't know if I did. Now, I did all this stuff, like salvaging, selling. Now, the salvaging I really needed to do because I had tons of stuff to do it. It took me a while to get through it all. And uh, uh, I ended up crafting a bunch of jet. I ended up crafting, uh, cooking everything I had, making stuff better. And it gave me a lot of experience, but not enough. And then I realized, what can I do? So I was like, you know what? I'm going to make cocktails. So I started making a crap ton of cocktails. I wasted all my oil. And I wasted a crap ton of, like, to make jet. And then I was looking, I was like, I can always make traps. Why is it I can always make traps? I never check traps because I never want to use them. And I realized they take metal. They take pure out steel. And look at this. Like, when you look at the caltrops, they're they're not that crazy. They're, they're only 25 gold, but they're 5 steel, and that's it. And they're only 0.5. But then I started going down, I went bleeding bear traps that's pretty damn good but look how much weight they are but even so i i made a couple and used up some of the gears but then i look at the poison cal traps it's 0.5 weight takes only five steel and it's 40 caps and usually when you're selling something it's half the cap so i want you to half the cap so they're at 20 caps per 0.5 that's pretty damn good. I ended up making about 500 of these. And 500 of these are literally just like... 500 is literally a good like... A, I don't know. I, I spent like a good like almost... Almost a little bit more than 2,000. And it made my money, almost all my, not all my money back, but it made a good amount of money back and it sold me what I needed to sell. And I'm actually at almost 4,000 caps right now because of it. So 
guys, if you guys want to make money real quick and you guys have like something really big to buy but you want to get that money back, instead of using like a hack or a cheat or something you're trying to do desperately, craft it. And by the way, if you're going to do this, definitely you have, if you have Admiral's Feast or anything like that, then I would suggest you put it on because you're going to be making tons and tons of this and it's going to give you like an extra point into everything that you're leveling up and it's going to make it worthwhile. Um, but crafting, literally, it just, all the traps, just, wow, I, that's like the best thing you can do, honestly. Those poison caltrops are just, hands down, like, the best. It's a pleasure to serve with you, sir. I mean, and I had Otto Loco carrying some for me. I had Otto Loco carrying the bear traps. He can only carry, the bear traps get heavy fast. I could only carry about 40 bear traps. He can carry only about 55. That was like, that was pretty big. I didn't realize how much the Keltrops actually weighed until you started raking them up. But I got some good stuff. Now, I, even though I weigh a lot, I can actually get to it. So let's get to the, uh, and I also walked, I literally walked to every settlement that, that I, that I saved and that I, that I owned and that I didn't kick all the people out because I thought there was too many settlements. Uh, I tried really, really hard to get everything that I needed and it turned out excellent. I mean, I leveled up and I realized that I didn't put all points into radiation. So I had one more point of radiation to put in, so I got four, now I'm 40% radiation resistance, which is really nice. So I'll show you what I'll show you what I have for uh, for my perk chart, and uh, see like I, apparently I forgot this. So I got some more radiation resistance. I was like, man, why am I taking so much radiation? And then I realized, oh yeah, I have plus 40 to my radiation resistance now. I have plus 50 to my energy, and I have a good plus. 50 did my damage so I'm doing really well so next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start boosting up like my commandos or actually I might just do the demolition uh, so I can actually build better bombs uh, because I have some pretty decent damage right now so right now let's uh, start a quest um, we can do the heretic, uh, so that's exactly what we're gonna do so I'm gonna take this off and we're gonna go to the holy sites which is right down here. So I think instead of going to the shrine, we can actually go right here. Technically, it'd be more logical to go right here to Adam's Spring, but let's just go right here for the time's sake and travel. Uh, we have Auto Loco with us. He's doing well. We actually got a lot of fiber optics now, so we can actually start making the uh, um, automatics that I want. Like I want to make laser. Uh, like the laser rifle, but in automatic form, because I, I love the single shot, don't get me wrong, but I have so many cells most of the time that I feel like it's going to be better just rapid firing at them. So let's just go ahead and... Oh, crap. It is... Dogs? What? Got it, man. I'm just breaking up the... Where are all these dogs coming from? Wow, that was a lot of canine power right there. That was insane. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and take what we can from these guys. I did see a mind over there, so apparently that was pretty gnarly. Alright, let me just recharge this. Actually, I am getting low on ammo for this, so... But I, I do like this gun. This gun's actually doing really well. There's a mind over here somewhere. I want to make sure I know where it is, though, before I... Oh, it's all the way over there. There you go. 
go. Easy disarm and easy take. Okay, so first things first, let's go and uh, investigate holy sites, investigate holy sites. So I guess it doesn't matter which one we go to. So let's go to the one. I'll say let's go to this one. So we'll go to this one, guys. Uh, this is actually pretty neat. I'm actually enjoying this. Man, where are these people coming from? Okay, we got those guys down. Oh, that was just one single trapper. That was... Alright, taking everything. Why is it missing when I hit brush? Wait, where did the guy die? I see you, dude. Can I can I have your body? There we go. Took a while, but I got it. All right, onward. I don't know if I should start using the flamer or what. Okay, so this is another. What is. Oh, that's a. Okay. I'm gonna start hopping up here. Hop! Oh, this, this ain't gonna work. Okay. This ain't like Skyrim where I can ride my horse up a mountain. This is a lot different. So let's just, uh. Let's just go around entirely. Let's just take everything that we see here. Apparently there's a lot of radiation here and I'm getting a lot. Okay, inspect. Scraps torn from some kind of banner. But it looks like some pieces are missing. Oh my god. Why is there so much radiation in the world? Ah, okay, okay, okay. We're going this way, we're going this way. Get, ah, I can't get out of the radiation. I know I have rad, but rad away, but seriously, I don't want to use it. God, they're so quick. Yeah, you know, screw this flamer time and Okay, I need to go flamer. Definitely go with a little bit of uh, Rataway mixed with a Okay, here we go. Burn, baby. You do not like me. I think I broke its leg. some of this? Oh gosh. Damn near. Hey, hey, come here. God damn it, you're so far away. You need to come closer. Oh, for the love of God. 
He keeps backing up on me. <laughs> Asshole. I swear, people are dicks. Where? What the freak? Now this guy wants to go. Fine, you want to go? I'll burn you to hell, bitch. Come here. Sometimes the flamer just speaks for itself. Okay, enough of this bull crap. Oh man, Auto Loco went down. What? No, I got you, baby. Okay, so we got that. Killed some gulpers. Now we're on to. Whoa, what was that? What was that? So apparently I had to kill some mole rats. Oh my gosh. This is, I swear, it's just like one animal after the other. I actually enjoy the flamer though, I really do. Flamer is nice, but eventually I will have to switch back to the shotgun. Or at least find a shotgun that's better, but so far I have not found a... I haven't found a legendary shotgun, not one. And it's a little bit depressing because I love using the shotgun. So, there we go. We're getting somewhere. Okay, here we go. Okay, just take... Lockatok Station. She must be staying at a campground. At least the directions are clear. Okay. Okay, hold on. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Okay. Got it. I just want to make sure that I get all the belongings here, because, like, even though that there's rat everywhere, and it's annoying. Am I crippled or something? No, I'm over encumbered. That's what I am. Okay, wow. Damn. It happens so fast now. It's like, uh, come here, Auto Loco. I need you. Come here. There's no rat over here. Hey. Come on. Oh, really? Why are you just turning? Inventory subroutine ready. So we're doing so far so good. I'm enjoying the flamethrower actually works really, really nicely. It actually, I feel like it works better than the, uh, the hunter's hood. That's what it looks like. That's pretty cool. I, I don't remember getting the hunter's hood. I remember getting like the hunter's pelt and everything, but this is kind of nice. This is kind of cool. The recon, the recon's actually even did. Damn, it does so, there's so much. I, I am armored out though, I'm not gonna lie. I am like, do not need any armor. But I do need like a storage unit on me at all times because I cannot pick up crap within crap. Uh, so let me just give him all this stuff since this is obviously taking a lot of time and effort so he can also take the marine ultralight. Uh, and, uh, sure, you can take some gulpert innards, irradiated blood, some meat. You like all the meat, I swear, man. You are a meataholic. You just love the meat. Alright, so there we go. We're good. We are going onward. Okay, so... Really, man? Come on! You're gonna burn! Burn, baby, burn! Effort in no 
know who he's messing with. But damn near took a lot of health from me. It's okay. I got I got health packs. It's all right. We're good. I have a lot of health. I'm good. I'm really good on health. So. Investigate the campgrounds. All right. I really don't need magazines. I don't need burnt magazines or burnt crap. I just need real stuff. Well, there's actually a pillow. Some wonder glue, which I don't really need. Fudge. Kill all the wolves? Why are there so many wolves going on? Definitely need tin cans and aluminum cans. Always need those. Okay, so now we're back to. Ooh, there's a hollow tape here. Ooh, let's play it. Done. The messages are posted. I, I know it could mean my life. But the children must know. I was painting through a pre-war tome when I saw it. The atom. A tiny speck of matter surrounded by endless depths. A vast emptiness that dwells within us all. It only reaffirms what I'd felt all this time. The truth the Confessor wanted no one to hear. The lie that is Adam. It's not real. We aren't all infinite worlds. Dead, cold. We are nothing. The professor won't be pleased by my messages. But I'm not afraid. I'm going to start moving things to the old church by the West Access Road in case. In case they decide to join me. I. I just hope I'm not too late to save them from Adam's lives. Now, this girl I really don't want to kill. Alright, I'm going to save it here, guys. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me on in this episode. Please remember to like, subscribe, and comment. I love all the comments. And uh, also, Critical Role is on Thursdays and uh, posting their videos on Mondays on Geek and Sundry. So please join them and watch them. Thank you guys so much and have a great one.